In a season of ups and downs, LSU's second round loss to Kentucky had both. A gritty, confident effort had LSU leading for much of the game. But ultimately, poor shooting and Kentucky's overall pressure just wore the Tigers down. A tough, tough, tough loss. Uh, I thought we competed as hard and as good as we have all year. It's unfortunate for us we had some, uh, we had some shots that didn't go down for us. I thought we were pretty effective in getting the ball deep in the post at times. And, you know, but let's give credit to them. Uh, that's not a good basketball team to beat us. That's a, that's a great basketball team. Overall, obviously, you want to get a win anytime you play, but to have a nice effort against your home state, what, what did that mean to you? You know, um, yeah, it's my own state, but, you know, this is my team right here. And we weren't able to capitalize the win, but, you know, I'm glad we came out fighting like we did. Um, fought all the way through the end, and they just got the win today. True freshman point guard Anthony Hickey and power forward Johnny O'Brien played vital roles for LSU in their first year and were both instrumental in LSU's first winning season since 2009. I mean, I love it, you know, um, freshman coming in, played against the best. Um, come back next season, it's, it's going to get better over, over time. You know, I got a lot of work to do. Um, I'm going to leave my team next year, and, and we're going to move on from there. It's been up and down. You know, I had my good times and my bad times. You know, um, could have been more consistent. But like I said, you know, um, just got to keep pushing, man, and um, have a better season next year. When they first got here as freshmen uh, in the summer, we told them that um, if they had to get in the gym and they had to put everything aside because we're not going to look at them as freshmen. We're going to bring it to them, and we're going to make them compete. And um, they had their ears pinned back, ready to learn. And then whatever you told them, they never took it as criticism. That's what I liked the most about them. Whatever you told them, they got in the gym late. And they put up shots if they worked on their game and they made the adjustments so, they can, so this time of the year they'll be ready. While the Tigers weren't ready to say for sure if they were NIT worthy, one guy was ready to put them into the field. Yes. And, and you know what's crazy is they were right on the edge of an NCAA bid. They hit that skid of games um, that hurt them. And, um, um, but yes, they do. I do. Uh, yeah, it would be great if we do. Uh, we just want to continue off this momentum. It's a tough loss, but we just need to look at the positives and just take that in the next game. I mean, if you ask me, hands down, we, I feel like we can compete with anybody that you put up against us. And um, I mean, due to the fact that, you know, Kentucky brought their game, we brought our game. And uh, the ball fell in their favor at the end of the game. But if you ask me, we can compete with anybody. So, But it's not my call to make. So, But I would love to continue to play.